Hi there. One of the things we used to be able to do very easily was take a YouTube playlist and embed it into a Google site using the HTML button. Well, over the last few years, uh, I should say a few months, that doesn't work anymore. Here's a quick workaround uh, to still be able to embed a playlist into your site. The first thing you do is get the embed code from YouTube. So here's a playlist that I've, uh, that I've created using uh, Google Apps playlists and more. And so all you have to do is go up here to the, the share button, click on that, and here is the URL to that playlist, basically to this page. But you go into the embed code here, and we're going to use some of that. So uh, you know, no longer does that iframe code work on a Google site uh, in, in this way. So the first thing we need to do is grab the playlist URL. Now, um, it's a little difficult to grab just the HTTP all the way out to the full screen, but uh, that's all you want. So it doesn't really work very well. So I'm going to copy this, and uh, I'm going to take that over to Google Sites. So here we go over to here at Google Sites. I'm going to paste that in. And now I'll just kind of steal this code out. Right? So I'm going to copy that out. There's other ways, of course, you can do this. Um, I want to kind of remember this 560 by 315 because that's going to come into play very quickly. <clears throat> so I'm just going to copy, uh, cut this, put my uh, cursor right here, and then I'm going to go into Insert Gadgets. See more gadgets? From this gadget menu, go ahead and select iframe or type in iframe. And the one I just comes up is this one. It works very well. So uh, select it and then go into where it says URL to the content and paste that. You know, just kind of give it a scrub through, make sure nothing's been added. Um, and now this is where we need to remember that, um, that width and height dimensions. Because by default, it's 600 by 800, which is just like a piece of paper or something. So uh, width is 560. You might be able to see it there very, very lightly. And then the height is 315. And then um, that's it. I'm just going to hit OK. You'll get a place mark for the gadget. I'll just delete this from before and then hit Save on my page. So here's your playlist. I love the videos. Um, I might need to change up the dimensions of this. Nope, it looks like it's going to be OK. What I love about it is if you click on this little button here, you can scroll, or people who visit your site can scroll through the many different uh, videos you have in your playlist. The best piece of all is that once a, once a video is done, it just queues up, excuse me, it just queues up the next video. No longer does it have related videos or any of that content that we don't necessarily want to see. Well, I hope that helps.